Hey guys, Charmed Wench here and I'm back again. Uh, this time I'm doing a video that I don't usually do. I was actually tagged by the lovely Lainey Muniz, uh, her channel. I will link it below so you guys will be able to find it. She is lovely, she does amazing makeup. You totally need to check it out. And subscribe. You always And give her videos a thumbs up because, yeah, they're good. Um, she's tagged me in a kind of get to know you tag thing. So there's like 21 questions and I'm going to answer them for you guys. Um, it may be choppy, I may ramble, but we'll get through this together. The first question is when is your birthday? Uh, my birthday is April the 18th, so it's coming up soon. I'm not going to tell my year because I'm too old. Too old for that. Question two, what are your three favourite colours? Now my colour choices change from time to time, as does my hair, so it depends kind of what mood I'm in as to what colour I go for, but generally black, pink, purple are generally the colours. I do love red though, red hair is good. But anyway, yeah, generally they change from time to time but black, pink and purple are, are pretty much my staple colours. Question three, what are your favourite quotes? I don't have many that I remember because my memory is terrible, uh, but my favourite quote from a movie is, we are the weirdos mister, and I'm going to see if anybody down below knows what film that's from. Uh, and my favourite inspirational quote is, thoughts are like seeds, you can either grow flowers or you can grow weeds. I love that, I don't know why, I, don't, I barely remember my own name most days but that quote has kind of just stuck in my brain, it's like imprinted there, I just think it's so cool and yeah, I keep saying it a lot. <laughs> Question four, are you addicted to YouTube? Yes. <laughs> Is there someone I can call for that or no? I, I want to be addicted to YouTube, I love, I actually watch YouTube more than I watch TV. So, yeah. <laughs> Question five, what are your favorite TV shows? I do love a sci-fi like maybe uh, Stargate or X-Files, um, but I do love Stranger Things. That is one of my ultimate favorite things. I mean, I cannot wait for season two. I'm so excited for season two, but I've got to say Charmed. You know, I love Charmed. I love Charmed so much. <laughs> I have it tattooed on me. I just grew up with the Charm series and I still have them all original on DVD. I wish they bring, I don't know if they have, but I really kind of need them on Blu-ray. Does anybody know if they do that? Because I need them all. Because <laughs> I have them on DVD, but I have a Blu-ray player now. So yeah, I kind of need to get them in Blu-ray. Question six, what are your three favorite qualities in a best friend? My three favorite qualities in friends would be loyalty, trust, and a good sense of humor because I love a good laugh and if you can't laugh in life then you'd have a pretty sad life. Question seven, do you like your name? Now I know my mom and dad watch this sometimes, they might watch this. <laughs> I think my name's okay, my name's Marie, <laughs> that is my original name, that is what I was born with, Marie. Um, but yeah, it could have been worse, they could have called me Pearl which is what they were thinking of calling me. Question eight, if you could pick any other name, what would it be? Now I've been thinking about this recently, which is really weird that I got tagged in this and this question is in this list of questions. And if I could change my name to anything, I would change my name to Gwen or Gwendolyn because that's what my nan's name was. Um, and yeah, and plus it's a cool name. Who wouldn't want to be called Gwen? It's cool. Gwen Stefani is like the coolest looking thing around. So yeah. Um, in memory of my nan, if my mum and dad wouldn't kill me, I would probably name myself Gwen. Question 10, if you could write a book, what would it be called? <laughs> Not really a person of many words when it comes to writing a book, but if I could have a book, um, it would be totally a makeup based book and it would be called If In Doubt, Blend It Out. <laughs> yeah, I like that. That's got a good ring to it. And that just came into my head all great. Yeah, that's great. I like that. Question number 11. Do you wear makeup? Well, if anybody watches this channel, they would know I hate everything about makeup. I, I just, I, no. Of course, of course I wear makeup. <laughs> Question 12. What makes you cry? I cry at literally everything. I am 
an emotional ball of mess. The slightest thing can set me, adverts make me cry. That's how much I cry <laughs> so easily. Films, if there's something sad in the film, I will cry. The things that I, I hate to be serious right now, but the things that make me cry the most, and I hate, I, I love Facebook, but I hate when you see videos of animals being harmed. That hurts me in a place I I can't even explain. If I slightly even see the video because I will not watch them, and if I have a friend on Facebook who shares a cruelty video, I know they're trying to bring awareness to it, but I it, it just breaks my heart every single time, and it genuinely makes me cry because I can't believe how cruel and how nasty the human race can actually be and it's the same with I hate to say it it's the same with the children ones as well on Facebook I cannot I just can't I, I just can't even know but yeah those are the things that make me cry <laughs> question 13 what makes you angry it takes a lot to make me get angry, generally. I'm quite a placid person, I'm quite laid back. You would have to push and push and push me for me to break and get angry, unless it's a certain time of the month. We won't go there, because that's gross. Um, yeah, but again, if you think of the previous question, that makes me angry too. It makes me so angry, I can't even put into words. So yeah, I don't get angry, but I do about that previous question, that, that situation that people could be so, what goes on in the human race's mind is all I can say. But on a lighter note, because I want to lighten this up because I don't want to finish like these questions on a really down note, I hate it when people put milk in the teacup before they put the tea bag in. That drives me nuts and my partner does it on purpose. Does it on purpose just to annoy me. <laughs> but yeah, that, that it actually really does make me so angry because it just makes the tea not work. Tea does not work when you put the milk in first. I like my tea to be hot, not like lukewarm. It's got to be hot. <laughs> so I've lightened it up with that bit, but that is totally true. I hate that. <laughs> Question 13, what makes you happy? I'm generally quite a happy person, um, but my family makes me happy. Makeup makes me happy and crisps. Crisps make me really happy. So yeah, <laughs> I'm quite a happy person. I generally think I am. And we have a bad day at work every now and again, which has happened <laughs> the other day. I had a really bad day at work on Thursday. It was not. It was not pretty. I just did not want to be there. But yeah, I'm quite a happy person. And if you give me crisps, I'll be even happier. Question 15: What is a fan girl? In my opinion, a fangirl is just somebody that is obsessed and or loves um, a certain person or celebrity. Um, yeah, there's not really much more I can say on that one. Question 16, what are your three favorite snacks? My three favorite snacks would have to be crisps, chocolate, and then probably some more crisps. Because yeah, that is my addiction. Other than makeup, I love crisps. I will try every kind of crisp there is. If there's something I haven't tried, I wanna try it. I really, really, really want the hot Cheetos. Everybody in America eats hot Cheetos. I need hot Cheetos. Somebody, somebody out there, please send me a bag of hot Cheetos and I will be your best friend forever. <laughs> Question 17, what are your three favorite foods? Other than crisps, we won't go onto that subject anymore. We will move away from the crisps. My three favorite foods are curry, which I really am obsessed with. with found a new curry house where we live and they do a mango chicken curry oh my god it is so good I love it and my second favorite food would have to be a BLT I love those I could probably have one of those every day and my third favorite food my third favorite food would probably be Sunday dinners I do like a Sunday roast with like everything and the York the Yorkshire puddings are always the best bit for me I love those with loads of gravy <laughs> But yeah, we have a Sunday dinner every Sunday. My daughter comes down and we have a Sunday dinner together, so it's great. Question 18, what are your three favorite drinks? Now I know I don't drink enough. I don't like the taste of water. 
unless it's really cold. If it's really cold, I've got no problem with it. But if it's just like tap water, I don't like it so much. So yeah, if I had to choose three favorite drinks, I drink tea every day. <laughs> we won't go into my tea rant again, but yeah, I drink tea a lot. Um, I do like a good fruit juice, like tropical juices and things like that. And Capri Suns, I'm obsessed with Capri Suns. But yeah, if I had to choose a fizzy drink, it would probably be, it would probably be just Coke really, because yeah. <laughs> Question 19, tell us a little bit about yourself. I'm kind of doing that already by doing this video, so I don't think I really need to answer that question. So we'll move on to the next one. Question 20, 10 random facts about me. I struggled with this question so much. I don't even know if I've got 10. I actually wrote them down. I struggled with them that much. So I will read my uh, 10 random facts. How many did I do? One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, I actually did, I did 10. Okay, so 10 random facts about me. I love owls. I, I can't even, they're the most beautiful. They're just so fluffy and so beautiful. I always have one with me when I'm filming. Isn't he cute? I'm so sad because the other day I haven't, my mum brought me an owl umbrella and it had a beautiful like snowy owl print all over it and the wind the hurricane doris was it Hur hurricane doris blew my goddamn umbrella inside out and i couldn't get it back down and i was so sad when it broke so yeah that's fact number one fact number two i have four piercings it's random i guess uh, fact number three, I have 11 tattoos. I would probably have more, but my dad would moan at me because he hates them as well as my piercings. Um, if you want to know what kind of tattoos I have, just, just ask in the comments below. You know, Obviously you've seen the charmed one and I have a little mermaid one up here that you can't really see very well. But uh, yeah, I have a few. I even have an owl one. <laughs> so yeah, I've got 11 tattoos altogether. Next random fact is I love witches. I love witches and magic and yeah, I think if I could be Wiccan, I probably would <laughs> because I just, the, the whole the whole thing with witches is just, oh, I just love it. And that's another tattoo I have as well. So yeah, I, I love witches, hence the charmed obsession. Next fact is I've lived all over the world. Um, I was, uh, a pads brat is what it's called in England um, but my dad was in the army so I've lived all over the world I've lived in places like Hong Kong Germany uh, where else have we lived there was quite a lot of places in the UK um, quite a few places in Germany Hong Kong's the furthest away I've lived I think yeah so that's a random fact for you <laughs> another random fact is I was actually born in Germany yeah I <laughs> why did I do yeah <laughs> like you guys know yeah i was born in germany um obviously for the same reasons before my dad was in the army and i was born in hanover don't speak i speak a tiny tiny bit of german but i don't speak much um enough to get by because obviously i've lived there as i've got older as well uh, next fact is i have a degree if you'd like to know what the degree is in you'll have to leave me a comment below and ask me Oh, another random fact is I can't watch people brush their teeth. <laughs> it, it sounds so weird to say out loud and I haven't told, like I think my partner is the only one that knows, now you guys in the world knows. Um, I can't watch people brush their teeth. It really weirds me out and to the point where I physically get covered in goosebumps. Like my entire thinking about it now, thinking about somebody brushing their teeth is making me want, to, oh, I I just can't. And it makes my teeth feel really weird as well. <laughs> God, you guys must think I'm so weird. But yeah, I can't watch people brush their teeth. <laughs> uh, two more random facts and then I'm done with the random facts. Um, I used to own a pet iguana. Um, that was when I lived in Germany once. Uh, we got a pet iguana. I think they're like tropical creatures are more easier to get a hold of in uh, in Germany. I think the pet shops just seem to have because we lived by a pet shop and and that's where we got our little oh, our little iguana. We called him Snoop. When I was back in the days where I liked rap music and I liked Snoop Dogg. I don't I don't listen to that music anymore. <laughs> that was my youth. <laughs> 
But yeah, I had an iguana named Snoop. Who really, weirdly, liked Britney Spears songs. Because if I put it on the radio, he would run to the side of the tank where the speakers were. And he would listen to it. It was so weird. I'm a slave for you was the only song though. It's crazy. Um, the last <laughs> random fact is... Mm, <laughs> I don't like my ears being touched like I'm, I'm okay with this bit but like if some like you know when you go to the doctors and they have to look inside your ears which I've been having problems with lately but we won't go into that but like when they stick that thing down your ear oh it literally makes my toes go I, I can't oh I can't I can't I'm putting eardrops in there like the feeling of the ear drop going oh I just <laughs> I bet I'm pulling some right random faces. It's because I'm experiencing it as we speak. But yeah, I, I don't like inside my ears being touched. Which is weird because obviously I have one of my piercings is actually a Dave piercing. I don't know whether you guys can see it. But um, I was okay with that. I would never have it done again. Probably one of the worst piercings I've ever had in my entire life. But um, yeah, I was okay with that. But the, the stuff inside, no, no, no. No. And the last question, 21, is three fun things I like to do. Um, shopping. Shopping for makeup would be more specific. Um, I do like walking. I don't know if it's just because I've got older or something, but um, yeah, I like, we like going on walks in our family, especially when we've got all the kids together. Um, and watching movies. I do like watching movies. There is so many good movies out at the minute that I've been watching. Passengers, I quite liked that. That was quite good because obviously it had the sci-fi sort of side to it that I like. And trolls, <laughs> I like trolls. <laughs> Got poppy hair, so <laughs> yeah, there's so many cool video uh, videos. Yeah, there's so many cool uh, films out. So yeah, that's the third thing. I like watching movies. So now you know a lot more about me. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video, especially you, Lainey because it wasn't awkward much filming. Um, yeah, I, it wasn't too bad actually. It was quite, it's kind of like having a chat with you guys, which is quite nice. And I probably rambled on for way too long and this video is gonna have to be edited, which is my least favorite part of YouTube sometimes. But um, yeah, it's been a good video. So what I will probably do is I will uh, write the questions down below in case any of you guys wanna do it. And I will also tag three YouTubers as well so that they can do it hopefully they enjoy doing it as much as i have because actually it's not been too bad so yeah and that is it guys um it's been fun and i'll see you all again soon bye